think we're set for the weather today. It'll yeah. be pretty good. Yeah, we're, we're set, no doubt about it. We got the forecast set, that's for sure. And it's going to be a little bit turbulent as we go through, especially the second half of the weekend and maybe even into early this coming week, Monday and into Tuesday. So a lot to talk about here, but relatively quiet right now. Adam Waukesha, pretty picture looking out over the Fox River and Frame Park at the falls there. Let's check some temperatures right now for you. 64 degrees, dew point also 64, so relative humidity, no surprise here. 100%, a very light south-southwesterly wind just at three miles an hour. So the rain for the most part overnight missed us. We had some showers around, especially south around Racine and Kenosha. A couple of showers, rumbles of thunder. Uh, Chicago got hit much harder, but our weather headlines really feature around some heat and humidity, at least initially as summer is back today, tomorrow, right through Tuesday with temperatures kind of building through the 80s over the next couple days, approaching 90 degrees by Monday and into Tuesday as well. And along with that high humidity returning, you will really notice that we'll have some heat indices early this week looking like probably in the 90 to 95 degree range. So definitely hot and humid stuff. And some of that moisture will condense out and fuel the potential at least for some strong, maybe even severe storms, maybe Sunday night into Monday morning and then again on Tuesday as well. So again, that's that turbulence in the forecast here as we round out the weekend and early this week. So temperatures right now, mainly mid to upper 60s all around southeast Wisconsin. How warm will we go today? Well, much warmer than we were yesterday. In fact, temperatures here into the lower 80s in most locations, Milwaukee, County, even into Waukesha County, maybe out to the lakes region, a little bit cooler, upper 70s, but fairly uniform here to the south as well. Highs in the low 80s later on this afternoon. Southwesterly winds generally about 6 to 12 miles an hour. And then up to the north, the cloud cover lingers a little bit longer here. That might hold temperatures mid to upper 70s from Fond du Lac to Sheboygan, also portions of Dodge and into Washington County. So here's that satellite radar combination. Notice the rain shifting eastbound now, relatively quiet upstream from us, and that is the the clearing that will take place across the area today. Here's our future forecast showing those southwesterly winds bringing in that warmer air. And again, it looks like the clouds will decrease. The sky's becoming mostly sunny into the afternoon and then quiet tonight. Here we are at 11 o'clock, so mostly clear skies. The air will be calm, not much wind, so we could see some patchy fog develop as we go through the overnight hours, maybe even dense into tomorrow morning. But as we go through the day on Sunday, partly cloudy skies were dry through the day, but watch what happens after sunset. Here we are at 9 o'clock and then into the overnight hours, showers and thunderstorms, several rounds breaking out coming through the area. And again, some heavy rainfall, maybe some strong storms there. In fact, the Storm Prediction Center out of Norman, Oklahoma has highlighted us for that slight risk of severe weather late Sunday and into early Monday. So that's along with those high dew points. Look at this building through the week by Tuesday, looking for dew points into the mid 70s. That will create those heat indices near 95 degrees. All right, those 80s for, for high temperatures uh, through the weekend into early week with those thunderstorm chances through Tuesday and then that cold front comes through and much better by Wednesday and Thursday with sunshine and highs in the mid 70s. Julia Lance, thank you so much. The